Hi everyone, it's James here, back with another video. We are here with Danza. She's actually been fasted for about 24 hours now, but I just thought I'd do you another video of what a uh, typical raw feeding meal looks for us, uh, looks like for us. So as you can see there, we've got some duck necks. She's gonna have one of those. We've got some Nutriment whole mackerel, which as you can see, they're 100% fresh and British. Danza's very excited. That's already in the bowl there. And then we've got the dog butcher working dog food there as well. That's the ox trot complete with chicken. That's 80% meat, 10% bone and 10% offal. And then if you've been watching some of my, one of my other videos, my last walking video, You'll know that I've been reading the Bath Diet book from Ian Billinghurst. Um, and what we've got here is some spinach and red pepper that I've put in a food processor today. Um, and that basically represents or replicates um, a wild dog or what a dog would eat when hunting down an animal and eating the... Um, the plant matter inside the intestine. So what I'll do is I'll put this all together um, in the bowl and I'll get back to you and I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, so there it is everyone. We've got the duck neck in there. We've got the mackerel. We've got the um, ox, tripe and chicken complete. And also there, there's the spinach and red pepper. All I basically did with that guys is got two handfuls of spinach and some leftover red pepper that I hadn't um, eaten myself that I kept in the fridge. Um, just put what was left in there, took the seeds off, but put the rest in the uh, food processor and just processed that um, until it was, um, until it looked like that basically. Um, and that's basically it. There's this, there's, there is quite a bit of food there, but as I said, um, Danza has been fasting for um, a full day, so we've just um, not fed her yesterday. So this will be the start of her feeding again. So yeah, the the duck necks, bit of bone in there, great for dogs. And the fish, well, Danza just loves the fish. And then, like I've mentioned in a previous video, if you've not checked it out, is that we use these as a as a kind of staple for our for our diet for Danza until we start doing our own food um, and getting food from butchers and whatnot. So, yeah, I um, hope that all makes sense, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have, uh, click the like button, uh, consider subscribing, and um, I'll see you on the next video. Obviously, it wouldn't be fair to uh, not show you Danza munching on a little bit of it. So, here we go. There we go, got the eye contact. And as I've said again, previous videos, Danza has no problem with any kind of food. So, some feeding videos of of dogs, I've seen them sort of avoid the spinach, but Danza will go straight into that. Not a problem at all. There you, go. you can see her munching through that as well, so she does make sure it's all crunched up before she takes it down. That chasing the bowl around. As you can see, she's still lapping it up, trying to get all of that spinach and red pepper. There we go, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Like I said before, um, hit the like button and uh, consider subscribing for more videos. And I'll see you on the next one.